It's game day in CE Games, and we are in for a good one as we have our Lady Rams facing off against the Fayetteville State Broncos in a heavyweight Southern Division matchup. Last time these two faced off, the Rams lost in double digits. This time, they came out seeking vengeance. To start the matchup, our ladies looked to catch fire early and came out aggressive both defensively and offensively. Because of that aggression, they were able to create scoring opportunities just like they did here. Although the Rams came out swinging, the Broncos were also making great plays. They even ended the half with a transition bucket to increase the scoring margin. Coming out of halftime, down six, the Rams were able to cut the lead down and went on a nice run, locking down defensively and scoring in transition. After the run by the Rams, they will show why they are first in the division and counter the Rams scoring with scoring of their own. Coming down the stretch, both teams went back and forth. High game with under 10 seconds of regulation, the Broncos made way to the free throw line and went one and two to take a one point lead. With the chance to score and win the game, the Rams were able to find a good luck on the floor from three. But this one doesn't go in. We, we held Fayetteville State at least 20, per, well, 20 points below their average on top of they're one of the top teams in the nation. So that tells us how good we really can be when we want to play hard. I thought defensively we did a good job, but I didn't realize we had 30 turnovers. That'd kill you every time. So we got to figure out a way to hold the ball and, you know, not make those crucial turnovers. Hey, that would do it, y'all. Lady Rams came up short, but they fought to the very finish. Next week they'll take on Shaw University at Shaw. So we hope that you come out and support. Thank you for tuning in Ram Life, and that'll do it.